so hey love and welcome back to my channel in case you're new here my name is nichi on today's video i will be giving you guys your skincare beginner friendly tips or advice starting from basic things you need to purchase and you need to get um when you're starting your skincare which is what i like calling my self-care journey because skincare is self-care all right so stick around and don't forget to subscribe one more thing you don't need to break a bank if you're starting your skincare journey this video is kind of like a guide so that you have an idea you really don't need to follow every step 100 like all the, everything i get list on this video something that will give you an idea of what to do of what to have of what to buy secondly for those of you that have been requesting oh you need to give us your skincare routine do a skincare routine video be patient i will do that video real soon and I'm just trying to get things organized because I have certain exams I'm working on so I need to get them done with um, and a whole lot more so <laughs> I don't want to keep you guys waiting so I'm just kind of like dropping this beginner skincare um, friendly tip video for you guys to just have an idea of what a skincare routine should have and all that so make sure you enjoy do me a favor give this video a thumbs up and without further ado let's dive right into today's video so tip number one get yourself a skincare bag a toiletry bag where you can put all your skincare products in it it will help you stay organized okay? something like this this is very good this is fantastic in here i have my hand cream i have my uh, face serum the ordinary face serum for hyperpigmentation i have my um, feet cream um, to help um, rough scaly foot you guys know what those i'll open this bag later to just show you the few things in it basically i need to still restock but this is just to help you stay organized when you're starting your skincare journey or skincare routine okay you also need something like an exfoliating set or an exfoliating sponge um this is like an exfoliating uh, hand glove it's punchy it will help you exfoliate your skin clean off the dirt this is the one i'm currently on self. something like this to exfoliate your skin with um there are many exfoliating equipments out there um, some for the face but this is quite gentle on the face and then at the same time it does a whole lot of you know exfoliating on your body like it cleanses your skin very well if you're purchasing please make sure you're getting the original not the fake okay all right so this is basically step one your toiletry bag your exfoliating um hand gloves and all that so now let's move into tip number three body scrubs and face scrubs very very important if you have an acne prone skin get something that has salicylic acid like neutrogena face wash or oriflame salicylic and pomegranate face wash very nice i've reviewed the oriflame products before on my channel so please make sure you watch that video maybe i'll leave a link up below on or down on the description box okay all right so when it comes to your body you definitely need to get yourself a sugar scrub or a salt scrub cool spa salt is there there are many amazing spa salts you can get for 1500 naira or just a thousand naira or even 800 naira i'm going to leave the pictures of the ones i'm talking about so just make sure you get yourself something to exfoliate your body a sugar scrub or a salt scrub very 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 important i've talked about the benefits of using a sugar scrub and the benefits of using a salt scrub if you've not watched that video please go to my video um, catalog or checklist and check out the video and see if you would watch it otherwise i'll still leave a link to that video down on my description box okay all right all right so you need a body wash yes you need a body wash let me show you my favorite body wash so you, you can get any body wash you want mine is quite expensive or pricey but you can get from 1500 naira to 2000 naira or higher 3k it's not it's worth it you need to get yourself a body wash or even a body soap something to wash your body with there is nano extra white i think i've made a review on soaps um there is um extract soap there are many soaps out there very affordable from 500 naira to a thousand naira please make sure you invest in getting yourself a good body soap you can also use body washes this is my favorite body wash this is the beast Mead, um super milk bubble bath um i think i've talked about this particular um body wash before here on my channel i've reviewed it um yeah i'm currently out of it like as you can see for some people they'll be like oh what body wash are you using this and that this is my go-to um it's around 3500 naira if it's not 4000 naira if it's on the pricey side for you i'm going to make i'm going to tell you guys other ones you can definitely try and purchase out there but this is my own the cottage fresh soap we have the asante papaya soap 
Um, there are many soaps out there you can definitely body soaps you can definitely purchase which are very affordable and not expensive. Need a face soap. Face soaps are just something that are more gentle. They don't contain too much perfumes or fragrance to break you out or to give you contact dermatitis. There are many face soaps out there. At the moment, I'm using beet charcoal soap. Um, there are very mild, gentle soaps out there. So do well to see if you can get yourself a face soap. Otherwise, you can get yourself a face wash from Simple. Simple has a face wash. I think that's around 3,000 Naira or thereabout. There are other ones too. So please do your research and find out what works for you. But otherwise, all these things I'm talking about, you know the things you really need. So much you're sure going to get everything I'm saying, okay? All right, so when it comes to body creams and body lotions, oh, geez, there are so many products out there in the market. So many, like, I've not even started reviewing half of what the market has yet. So, but I will definitely give you guys a tip at a time, um, review the products and make you guys understand. But... Make sure you get yourself a body lotion or a body cream. Very important. Depending on... Okay, when I'm doing my skincare routine, I'll definitely go in details. That video will be coming up real soon. So expect my skincare routine video real soon. But otherwise, let's get back into the beginner-friendly tea. Nivea Natural Fairness. There is Purec Egyptian Lotion. If it works for you, there is Dove Moisturizing Lotions. These are just normal moisturizer. Um, moisturizing lotions you can purchase or try you know getting there is fair and white lotion there's nivea perfect radiant lotion there's there's extract among the cheapest you can get which is very nice you can get the foreign extract i had um there's a nigerian extract lotion and a foreign extract lotion so if you can get the foreign extract lotion with the soap that'll be just simple that's okay for you at least probably budget three thousand naira for everything if it's that expensive but i doubt i'm not checked recently in the market so extract soap and extract lotion will just do okay for you if you're starting out i've not been in the market recently or in the malls to find out their prices yet but i'm sure it's quite affordable and it's super simple so you can start from there nivea natural fairness quite affordable um nivea radiant also okay extract fantastic the soap and the lotion for a start there are a lot of lotions out there so you just figure out what you want all right okay we also have ambino moisturizing lotion if you're not into um if you don't have pigmentation problems dark spots or anything you want to clear on your skin but you just want to moisturize your skin avino is there and um, dove moisturizing lotions are there cetaphil they are expensive brands but they are quite um there are normal ones like even natural fairness something you can just use for a start if you don't want to go on you don't need to break a bank to have a perfect skincare or a very simple minimalistic skincare routine all right there's shea butter enriching lotion by jeggings that is the jeggings shea butter enriching body lotion there are quite there are there are a whole lot of very good simple moisturizing and affordable products so just start with what you can afford maybe from one five to two thousand naira upwards for your body lotions just you know on that on that scale um for a all start. right so for face creams you need face creams if you have dark spots or you're trying to clear out post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation that is caused by pimples or acne face creams like vitz gold face cream nivea perfect radiant cream anisa face cream face creams are products that will definitely help target your problem like the dark spots the acne or whatever you want to um get conceal or heal from your skin um, most lotions, it's not advisable to use your body lotions on your face um, because your body can actually tolerate more than the skin. The skin on your body can tolerate more than the skin on your face. So please make sure you, you get yourself a face. Oh, Beach Gold is amazing if you can get the original product. I think it's around 1,500 naira, very affordable. Um, there's the Anisa Gold Face Cream. This product is amazing. Um, this product has actually helped with my hyperpigmentation issues um i'm not going to say i have completely seen um like ugh, like half cast whatever results no 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 we're not talking of something that will bleach you or give you something that you don't yeah. want things that would help correct dark spots and uneven skin tone so this product contains alpha abatine it contains vitamin c it contains kojic dipamitate not even kojic acid just dipamitate and dipamitate is very good for sensitive skin so i can if you want me to tell you okay this is what i have tried this is it this is the anisa gold face cream 
um, it's really nice but have in mind that you need your SPF SPF is very important you need something like that may actually okay they are very cheaper SPF products I'm going to leave their pictures something from one five to two thousand but if you need my recommendation you should probably consider purchasing Neutrogena Shear Zinc SPF I'm going to leave a picture for if you have hyperpigmentation that's dark patches on your face and this is a dermatologically recommended sunscreen that is the Neutrogenia Shear Zinc. This is something I would love to purchase real soon. So in case you need my candid advice on a sunscreen, definitely consider getting that. But otherwise, if you want to go to the market, there are a variety of sunscreens. Just make sure you get yourself a sunscreen that works for your skin. All right. Okay. So sunscreen, very, very important if you're going under the sun because of our weather, because of the harsh environmental factors our skin has to endure. Now let's move into your serums. You need um, vitamin C serum, very, very important. This is a mistake I've made when I recently started my self-care journey. I didn't know about the benefits of taking vitamin C supplements or probably um, using vitamin C serums. So get yourself Dr. Ra uh, Dr. Rachel vitamin C um, serum. There is the ordinary has the ascorbic and alpha betaine serum. These are quite, the ordinary is quite like expensive, but Dr. Rachel should be around 2,000 Naira or 3.5 or thereabouts. It's affordable. Have the Raushun Vitamin C Serum. That's around 1,450. The Pretty Curry Vitamin C Serum. Very, very affordable. I think around 1,000 something or 2,000 naira. I'm not really sure. But if you want to go to higher brands, you first have to start slow. Have to start from, um, work your way up. You don't need to start big, big, big if you can't afford all the big luxury brands in skincare just a step at a time finally you need body oils the oils like almond oil the skin doctor has an almond oil maybe you can try purchasing um, the skin doctor almond oil you can also use ordinary shea butter but most people don't like the smell of shea butter so use almond oil I use normal regular almond oil I've, I've done a video talking about body oils I'm still going to leave a link down below or on um, or a card to take you to that video very very important these are the things you need in your starting out skincare your body oils your face cream your um moisturizing body lotions just simple stuff get yourself a bag and all that not a toilet bag but something that would help you store in all your skincare products and do check out the prices of the products you're getting you don't need to break a bank if you're starting skincare okay so this is kind of like a beginner friendly skincare tip or skincare advice so do well to subscribe for small videos like this and a whole lot more i hope this video talked to somebody it give gave you an idea of oh i'm lost where do i start from in skincare this is where you start from when it comes to skincare. Skincare. the basics for your skincare journey which is all about self-care journey so thank you so much don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up I'll see you guys on my next video.